12, episode 35 of Eagle News for Thursday, October 18, 2018. Welcome to today's episode of Eagle News. Happy National Cupcake Day. My name is Cammie. Our opening headlines. Remember, there's no school tomorrow. And 8th graders, make sure you have everything packed and ready to go for the Washington, D.C. trip before our luggage drop off on Sunday. And my name is London. The D.C. trip is four days. Get excited! Eighth graders, final reminder that luggage drop-off is this Sunday. Please make sure you drop off your luggage between four and six. One note, you do not need to hear to drop off, be here to drop off luggage as long as someone brings it in to check you in. Also, eighth graders, make sure you bring extra layers of clothes on the trip because it's going to be cold. Welcome to Trivia. Thank you, Cammie and London. I am Piper and I am with Juliana. And we are your lounge hosts. Welcome to Trivia. For today's trivia, please text Mr. Meta. Let's hear today's question. Get ready. Name something that you buy that would suddenly bring you a lot of new friends. Again, name something that you would buy that would suddenly bring you a lot of friends. Send us your answer before the end of the news, and we will share answers and point values at the end of the news. Today's first video. We have a thank you videos from us here in Eagle News to thank you to thank all of you. Let's check it out. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Gracias. Danka. Merci. Thank you for letting us edit videos that we show you. Thank you for watching our videos. Thank you so much, Eagles, for watching our daily broadcast. Every day, Eagle News produces a broadcast. Even when we make mistakes, you guys are there. Even when you are in the middle of something, you take the time to stop and watch. Thanks for participating in trivia. And thanks, teachers, for allowing us to bother you during your classes. Here at Eagle News, we'd like to say thank you for the way if you watch and participate our broadcast every day. Appreciate the great feedback we get on all our content that we make. It means a lot to us. We wouldn't be here without you guys. Every day, you guys watch and support us. Thank you, Eagles. Thanks for watching Eagle News every day. Thank, Thank you, you for, for watching, watching Eagle, Eagle News. News. the deli and get a wrap yourself a wrap pita or sub or a wonderful entree salad more headlines thank you london and cammy lunch sounds delicious make sure to subscribe to our broadcast and video projects on youtube just search hyatt's eagle news that way you can see all of our videos posted every day there is a tgif meeting today at two in the cave remember your permission slips Remember, there will be no Eagle News next week because 8th graders will be in D.C. Now to our second video story. The second video to for today is a video of teachers dancing around Hyatt's made by Gianna. Let's check it out. Hey Eagles, let's go check out dance moves around Hyatt's. Thanks for watching Eagles, now back to the newsroom.
was a great video. Now on to the lounge for sports. Last night in sports, in the National League Baseball playoffs, the Los Angeles Dodgers defeated the Milwaukee Brewers 5-2 to two, and now headed to Milwaukee with the three games to advantage in the series. And in American League, the Boston Red Sox defeated the Houston Astros 8-6 to six last night, surviving a bases-loaded bottom of the ninth attempt to win by Houston. Boston leads the series three games to one. Game five is today in Houston. There was so much hockey and pro basketball last night. We didn't have time to fill in on the, the fill scores. Fill you in. Fill you in on the scores. So if you want to know how your favorite team did, check out ESPN.com. And that's it for sports on Wednesday. Now please stand for the pledge. I guess today's Thursday, huh? Oh, it is. Oh, is it yeah. Thursday, right? Yeah, Thursday. Yeah. Thursday. Yeah. Thursday. Yeah. Thursday. We, that was my bad. All right, pause. Ready? <laughs> stand for the pledge? No, not you guys. You uh -huh. stand. <laughs> I, I, I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United, United States, States of America, America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all the top answers for trivia are um car number one answer was oh, number one answer was a car how many points 43 and nicolos he got that the second answer well, who was, were the other ones that got it oh thompson vogue and play hive are you sure thompson got it although she's got a lot of inside source here i want to check that <laughs> answer cameron no she got it all right she's lucky <laughs> Um, our second answer was a vacation home, and that's 19 points. No one got that. Uh, the third answer was a big screen TV, which was 12 points. No one got that. And our last answer was a swimming pool with 9 points. Holt got that. Congratulations. Woo! <laughs> Carrie, woo! <laughs> Yay! Congratulations to the winning advisories, and thank you for partici participating in our trivia so far. Now on to today's Google fact of the day. What kind of bees can sting more than once? Wasps and many bees can sting more than once because they are able to pull out their stinger without injuring themselves. Only honeybees have special hooks on their stinger that keep the stinger in the skin after a person is stung. The stinger gets torn out of the bee's body as it tries to fly away. Wow. Thank, Interesting stuff. Thank you for watching episode 35 of Eagle News for season 12. I am Cammie. Have a great Thursday. And I am London. Yes, have a good day. Come back in two weeks for another extraordinary episode of Eagle News. Now, now let's read. Let's get off those books and read. Bye. Bye. Here's what, Slana. Oh, uh, wait, hold on. Wait. Stay alive. Stay alive. We still love. No, Mrs. Sloan, wait, we're not which watching. camera? Sloan, which camera? Go to the lounge, Mrs. Wait. Sloan. Go to, go to the lounge. lounge. What's going on? Oh, oh, she's on fire. Hey. Look what, right here, right here. Right what here was trivia camera. today? Because I'm really disappointed I missed it. What was um, trivia? Read the question. Was. We don't remember the question. <laughs> what? How do you not remember oh, the question? Oh, What's oh, something oh, you would oh, get oh, that a lot of friends, you get a lot of friends from having it? Wait, what? Something you could buy to get you a lot of friends. Oh. What was it? Food. Food? I love food. No. <laughs> Car. See, I didn't get it. Today anyway. Yeah, that's okay. I'm really disappointed. I, I'm really disappointed. But now maybe I'm, I'm happy I missed behind it. Behind the camera, I want to be in Come there. Come on up. I'm kind of stuck. You are stuck. <laughs> You're right. That's our, our okay. state of the art studio. This is beautiful. Actually, this is the first time I've ever been in here. And you're like the star teacher. Hey guys, what can I say? <laughs> <laughs> say okay. Say. All right, Love say you. goodbye. Say have goodbye. A great weekend. Have a great weekend. Long weekend, and eighth graders have a fun time in DC. We'll miss you. Be safe and take care. Bye bye.